Welcome back guys and welcome to my new office, my new studio. It's a bit cramped, it's a bit uh, messy still. I haven't really figured out what the layout will be. Behind you there I have a TV for color grading or like a reference monitor just in front of it. I have a couch and then here I have my two monitors just coming in. So yeah, uh, I'll probably do a little studio tour when I'm more kind of up and running and a bit more functional. But today we're gonna talk about a really cool product, which is actually from a company that I reached out to because I think they do so cool stuff. And the company is Zepon or Zepon. Today we're gonna talk about the new product, the Zepon 100 Pro Multi-Axis Slider. And it's a long name, but basically what it is, it's one meter long slider where you can go like this, like this, and like this so you can move on three axes and you can make videos that look so great as you can see in all of my b-roll here everything is shot with the slider if it's not a shot of me of course uh, filming the slider okay so what can you do obviously it's a slider you can go from point a to point b and you can twist and turn going there what really struck me when i started it up it's so easy to use it's really easy to to set up compared to well, I can't really compare. I've tried the, uh, the Edelkrone. Yeah, the Edelkrone, they're a big one. And that you need an iPad and you need, you know, it's it's science to just, you know, get it to work. This is, you have a little monitor and it's really easy to just tick, 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 tick. Straight on the monitor in English or whatever language you want. You make it easy, point A, point B. And in that menu, you also connect this one which makes it the free axis slider instead of just one that goes like this and this um so the slider it's like it's fairly big it comes with um yeah it's one meter also comes with support rods if you want to put it on your tripod and you don't want it to flex so um, as you can see here in the video that really helped when having a little bit of a heavier a heavier setup going because no matter how you do it this setup can actually carry a 12 kilo camera horizontal and vertical it's a 3.5 kilo camera so fairly big setup for a mirrorless that you can do up and down but you can actually have a full cinema rig go on it from left to right which i think is amazing another thing with it is you have a lot of different ways to to run it you can run it with a regular usb-c you can run it with a power bank or as we all know these i think is in focus the Sony MPFs, yeah, we can run everything from Sony MPFs. That must be the most versatile battery in history. Yeah, so when, when you put it from A to B, if you put it like this and then you let it twist and look up, that's gonna be remembered in the A to B movement. And then you can go back and forth, back and forth as many times as you want. You also have to do uh, the speed. You can go from zero to 100, so you can go super, super slow. Like if I would have wanted to, I could have taken one in this video and started and go on the slowest and just let it pan over me to actually make it look a bit nicer which i would have done uh, if i think about it uh, one thing that i had some issues with was it was kind of a hard stop and then back but it wasn't actually the uh, the slider swap because i had the ivis on in the uh, camera so one thing to think about is when you're using a slider and it goes to the end point and then goes back just you know and shackle remove your ibis in the uh, camera because then you're gonna have steadier images which is you know sounds a bit weird but then again not because the ibis just kind of keeps everything at point i've tried another slider before from axoon as you might have seen in the video i have up here and i was pretty happy with that slider because you know it did what it was supposed to point a to point b whereas this one takes it to a whole new level and price-wise, it is not that expensive to have the entire free access. You have it for like 1200 euros. And then you have like the main engine, you have the extra rotating arm, so you can actually do the free access. You can also buy it just one that goes like this and you can twist and turn. But the amount of new angles and new things you can do when you have a free access compared to just a two axis, that's, that's insane because you can literally, you know, just in your wildest imagination like yeah i would love it to go like this and then this so um, it's a super easy one to use and it was super fast to set up and it comes in a nice bag so it's easy to carry if you want to bring it to a customer if you want to bring it to set it's not it's not very delicate it's 
from carbon fiber it feels sturdy and you have all these extra tools for it if something were to happen you can switch the motor band so um, as a, this one is built to be used it's not something you just should have in the studio like bring this bad boy out just play with it outside play with it in a car you know it's it's built for that and when it comes for comes to it's built for that i also mean it's built for us filmmakers it's built for freelancers i mean price wise if you can afford 1200 euros this is also a thing that you can rent out to people or to lend out to people depending on what kind of business you're in or how you want to do it but it's definitely not something that you're gonna have just laying on the on the couch mine is actually standing here in the studio always ready to go because i've used it for so many things from product videos to uh explaining videos to just regular cool zooming videos i'm gonna try to get a probe lens on it and just go into you know into the depths of a nice bottle or something we're, we're gonna get to that as well so i said this is for all of us that makes moving video and especially us that makes product videos or where you want to have some dynamics in interviews and things like that so that's the biggest use cases as i can see it when, when it comes to to negatives I wouldn't really say I found it's a bit when you have it, you know, all this long and it's tilting, it can tip over. But that's more from your tripod if you don't have a sandbags, which is, you know, your own fault. If it's, uh, yeah, that's just your own fault. Uh, that's what I did, and it was just stupid. So it's um, to recap it. It's around twelve to thirteen hundred euros, and then you get a free access slider that's one meter long. It's super easy to use, super easy to set up. You get it in a nice carrying bag. Um, you can use it for product videos, commercials, interviews, wherever you want, just not a static shot like I'm actually filming now. The only movements I have in my talking head now, it's boom, zoom in, or maybe a bit of zoom out, I, or I can move with some key framing. So this is actually a really boring shot. And now I'm already almost through the video, so I'm not gonna take uh, I'm, I'm not gonna set it up to redo the video now, but the next vlog I'm doing, I'm definitely gonna incorporate it because it's, yeah, it's nice. Um, but like I said, it's easy to use, easy to set up, very well priced compared to other competitors in the business. And you can also actually buy so you can do focus racking with it as well. If you don't have your own like DJI or an autofocus lens or whatever you want to go with. So if I would recommend this product, yeah, like usually you always try to be positive in YouTube videos about products because sometimes you get them sent to you, sometimes you buy them, but you always want to keep, keep good spirits. And I don't think I've tested any products that I didn't like so far on the channel, but this one, since I actually reached out to Zepon to do this video, that just shows that I am really into this product. And if I didn't get it, I would probably have rented it to see if it was something that I would want for myself. But Sipon sent this product to me to review. They will not see this video before. I might should have taken this uh, message in the beginning, but well, you know, sometimes, you know, disclaimer. Uh, so I got this product sent to me, but they won't see the video before I release it. But I cannot stress enough that this is a product that I think that if you have the money and you're looking for something to enhance your videos or something to give some more dynamic into your you know videos or product videos this is actually the perfect product for it and this is exactly what they developed it for so yeah I think that's it thank you for looking sorry for not being super active I'm trying to put out videos all the time but now we moved offices I'm gonna make a little office tour once it doesn't look like shit in here uh, you can't really see my desk here now, but it's a, it's a phone here, it's that there, it's papers, it's a V-mount, so it's full of crap right here, right now, so I need to figure that one out, and I need to see how to build this studio setup. I might put some lights in the roof or something, so I'm always, you know, you can just go dick, flip it on, but for now, uh, it is what it is. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys soon. Bye!